Hi, it's Bex from the Wide Boot Company and today I am doing a try on of the new Equine Splendor polo shirt. I really love these, so really excited to show them to you. Hi everyone, it's Bex from the Wide Boot Company and today I am doing another Equine Splendor clothes try on. So Charlotte who runs Equine Splendor, I messaged her because I saw her new polo shirts. Um, on her website and I was like oh I really really like those I don't know about you but I feel a bit like everything has gone to very clingy sort of stretch fabrics and technical tops that are all very sort of clingy materials and you know I mean I did my own range of technical tops and, and they're a bit thicker but I just find a lot of them are so clingy and the other thing is they do feel a little bit sort of sweaty in the summer when you get hot I find they don't have that nice breathability of cotton uh, and then the other problem I found was a lot of polo shirts that you can get now are so branded like you know they've got huge logos across the front or on the sleeves or badges embroidered on them and um, I don't really like that kind of clothing I like things to look sort of quite subtly branded so anyway um, I had a look at the website and I thought oh these are so lovely the colours I couldn't pick between the three colours as it was and um, so I said to Charlotte, um, I was interested in some and what was the fit like as well. And she offered to send me a couple of different sizes so that I could try them on and just give her some feedback on the fit. So um, as you know, if you've seen any of my other vlogs, I am quite curvy. Um, so I am about a 36F to G cup um, on top. And I generally wear anywhere between a size 14 to 18 on top depending on the brand but I would say you know about a size 16 in most tops and um, I am five foot six and I wear about a size 16 on my bottoms so uh, that gives you sort of a rough idea of my size so um, anyway so here is my parcel that I turned up I'm just going to open it up and get a few of the uh, tops out and have a look at them and then I'm going to try them on and see which ones I'm going to keep and yeah hopefully we'll see what what the um fit is like and whether they're going to be going to be a good one for me so here we are packaged up and uh, I'm just going to stop the camera for a moment while I get them out and get them unwrapped so I don't tear the packaging in case I need to return them okay so I've just opened the package and um, as usual, there's a very nice little note with some polos stapled to it with um, a postcard. So, um, yeah, I mean, I really love their britches as well. I, I pretty much live in the riding tights because I find them a really great price. They've got two pockets, which I really like, so I can put my phone in one and my keys in the other. Um, and they just fit really well. They're very comfortable and they don't roll down or fall down on me. So um, just for reference, I'm a large in the riding tights. And uh, I think I've actually, yes, I have. I've got my, um, these ones on today, which are very nice. <laughs> um, so yeah, these are the three colors. So there's this one, which is sort of like a green, olivey sort of color, which is really nice. Um, this one, which is a gray with a sort of burgundy pinky sort of tone on the collar. And then this one, which is more of a blue. So these are the XL ones. So I think um, I'm gonna try on the gray one first. Yeah, I really like the gray. So I'm gonna try that one on first and then uh, just do a quick assessment of the fit. So give me a second and I will get out of my top and put this one on. So yeah, as you can see, they're really nicely packaged in these other storage bags as well. So. Okay, so that actually looks quite a nice fit. So where I struggle with a little bit is the sleeves because I am quite muscular here. So I do find sometimes that these sort of tops can be cut a little bit tight into the armpit and across the sleeve, but these look like they're quite generous. So um, the thing that appealed for these for me was the fact that they are mainly cotton, but they do also have a little bit of stretch in them as well. So yeah, I think that's a really nice fabric and they're sort of like a, I would say a medium weight. So they're not really, really thick, but they're also not thin and clingy. So that's pretty perfect for coming into summer. So I'm just gonna pop this one on and uh, see what I think. 
will probably help if I undo the top of the buttons so that I can get my big head in. Right. So yeah, so that's the XL. Now I do quite like the fit of that. Um, and as you can see, it's got these really, really lovely prints. So um, at the Equine Splendor leggings all have this sort of different floral prints uh, or some of them are slightly sort of like the white uh, show britches that I've got have got like a sort of snow flaky kind of print on them, which is really pretty. Um, but that's what I really like about them because I think that it's subtle and it gives a bit of colour. So it's not just like a boring one colour top, but um, but it's also, you know, you can hide it as well if you want to button it up. It's going to be not too obvious. So um, I'm planning to be able to use these to wear to the office as well because I think they're smart enough I could get away with wearing that for my office job. So yeah, I do like the fit. Um, it's definitely on the more fitted side of things, but that's I, do, I, I quite like things relatively fitted because I think sometimes if you wear things too loose and baggy, it just looks a bit shapeless. So um, I'm going to try on the XXL and just see what difference that makes in terms of the fabric drape, whether it's a bit less clingy. I think that's the only area I would maybe want it a little bit less clingy, just on my tummy. Um, but yeah, I think that's quite a good fit. Um, the other thing is, Charlotte has designed these to have a rounded back, so I'm not quite sure if you can see that, but um, the back of them is, has got like a slight round here. So they're not just like a straight, short cut that's going to ride up because I think the other problem you get if you're curvy is that quite often tops just do this and it drives you mad because then you'll be riding along and you're constantly pulling them down and trying to tuck them in um, but this feels like it's quite generous over my hips I don't feel like I'm you know it's got quite quite a bit of space there um, so I like the cut so yeah I'm just going to try on the XXL on another size and um, and I can decide between the two and just decide which colours I'm going to keep. Um, I'm probably quite tempted to have all three colours because I think these are going to be really practical. And I am very low on riding tops at the moment. After a very wet and muddy winter, everything has got pretty wet. <laughs> I'm sure you're all in the same boat. So give me a second and I'm going to get the XXL one out. Okay, so this is the more blue coloured one. And the XXL. And yeah, I'm really impressed with the quality. If I just come up here closer. Um, so it's an embroidered logo. I really like an embroidered logo because I just think they're, um, you know, you don't, you don't get the peeling off that you sometimes get with iron on logos. Um, and then just to show you the co collar. So it's this nice sort of slightly ribbed cotton effect collar here. And then the rest of it is the more stretchy, slightly thinner material. So let's just pop this one on. Right, so actually uh, I do think that's slightly nicer. So it's, um, I certainly didn't feel like the other one was too tight but I just feel this is a little bit more of a relaxed fit um, and it's not quite so clingy across the front here, which is what I want to get away from. So um, yeah, but definitely, you know, there's plenty of space in the arms here, which is always the problem area. Um, and I love the color. I think that's so pretty it, and it, you know, it would just go with so many things as well. So I think you could wear these with jeans or lighter coloured breeches or they would go with like navy or um, the olive coloured breeches would go with these as well, the riding tights um, and obviously they don't look too bad with this sort of teal colour, maybe a bit too matchy matchy. Um, well, actually I don't know, I quite like it. Yeah. Anyway, um, so yeah actually I think I probably will keep the XXLs just because I feel like they're a little bit more relaxed fit. So, and because I have got a bigger bust, I do need that bit of extra space. So yeah, um, I guess before I go, I will quickly show you the olive one, which is also a really lovely color. So I'll just pop this one off. Yeah, I mean, I have to say, if I'd have just ordered the XL, 
I would have been quite happy to keep that. It wasn't certainly wasn't like a so clingy. I didn't like it. Um, but yeah, XXL I think is going to be the way to go for me. So let's just undo. I should have done that before I tried to put it on, really, shouldn't I? Okay. So yeah, again, I actually love this colour. Um, it matches my eyes. <laughs> so yeah, I really, really like this sort of um, colour, and it's quite traditional as well. Um, you know, I don't. I'm not hugely into really, really bright colours. Uh, as I know, a lot of slightly larger people, we don't necessarily like to bring attention to ourselves by having super bright colours. So these are perfect. Um, I'm really going to get a lot of wear out of these because I can wear them pretty much for anything, for work, for the horses, for riding, just for around the yard. Um, and this is just so pretty. I mean, look at the lovely prints. They are so adorable. And the buttons matching, every, you know, the colour matching of the buttons as well. I just think the detailing's really, really nice and um, I feel like they're going to wash really well. So yeah, I'm just going to tip the camera down just so you can see. Oh, hang on a minute. Oh, there we go. So that just shows you the length. And yeah, I do think that's really nice. So thank you very much, Charlotte, for sending me those to try. I'm going to stick with my three XXLs and return the XLs. Um, but yeah, I hope you've enjoyed the review. Check out Charlotte's website, which is Equine Splendor. I will put the link on here with the actual website address. Um, check it out. I really, really like the quality of her stuff. I've been buying them for now, probably a year or two. Um, and I, you know, they wash really well and they last a long time. And I think they're a great price for what they are. So, um, and you know, now, now that she's got the competition britches out as well, if you're somebody that goes out competing, then that option is really great too. Um, have a look at the old vlog as well if you want to look at the competition rich review because I thought, um, you know, they, they're really, really lovely and I've worn them a lot and they've washed really well. So, yeah, really pleased with them. So, thank you, Charlotte, and um, I'll get these other ones back to you and catch up with you all soon. Thank you. Bye. So I really hope that gave you an idea of the fit of these tops. I would highly recommend them if you get a chance to buy one. And there is the Equine Splendor website link there. If you enjoyed the vlog, please hit subscribe to be notified of future videos.